tell you the story about the bucket of filth <laughs> and what goes into the bucket of filth. Last night with a walk-off home run, check out Anthony Rendon over here up top. He's got the bucket of filth. And we're going to go back to it. We'll get back to it. And I'm going to tell you guys what's in the bucket. So there's coffee in the bucket. There's bubble gum and seeds in the bucket. Obviously, water. Last night, they put some Alka-Seltzer in the bucket of filth. <laughs> some Gatorade bars for projectiles, because you have to do some damage when you throw the bucket of filth on somebody. So it starts in about the ninth inning of a tie game or when you're down by one. The longer the game goes, the more stuff is added into the bucket of filth so that it's filthier. And I'm hearing that last year there were some long games and it gets kind of creative and interesting as they go on. It's kind of like a superstition. The more weird stuff we put in the bucket, we're hoping that the game ends on a walk-off. I don't think Michael Taylor was too thrilled last night about what was in the bucket of filth, from what I understand. <laughs> and there's all kinds of secret ingredients, kids, that I can't describe because this is a family show yeah. <laughs> that are in the bucket of filth. Trust me, it definitely has earned its name cool. correctly, the bucket of filth.